Want a beautiful new smile without wearing braces? At Wilson Orthodontics, we're the area's only premier preferred provider of Invisalign, the revolutionary clear way to get that awesome new smile. That means we're Invisalign experts. And we're the only provider north of Atlanta using the iTero Scanner, a digital scanner that eliminates the need for those gaggy, gooey impressions. Discover more at WilsonBraces.com or call us to schedule a free consultation. With this Access News break, I'm B.J. Williams. For the first time since her 16-year-old daughter was found dead this past August, the mother of Hannah Trulove spoke with the media. Mona Harris read a statement at a press conference Wednesday asking for the public to bring forward any information they might have in her daughter's murder. Hannah Trulove was stabbed multiple times and found dead on August 24th behind an apartment complex off Dawsonville Highway in Hall County. The Gilmer County Sheriff's Office reports that with the aid of a tracking dog, they were able to capture James Michael Stafford of Ellijay Wednesday. Stafford had been on the run since February 10th when he was allegedly involved in a shootout with four men who came to his home to collect a debt. Two of those men were shot in the head and a woman also was injured. Five people are dead after the business jet they were in crashed last night in McDuffie County, about 30 miles west of Augusta. Investigators are saying the pilot appears to have overshot the runway while trying to land at the Thompson McDuffie County Airport. The pilot and one other passenger survived the crash. The plane had taken off from Nashville. And state and federal wildlife officials in Georgia and North Carolina announced an undercover poaching operation Wednesday. Authorities say the poachers were violating both state and federal law by hunting bear and serving as guides to illegally take bear on federal land, mostly in North Georgia counties and across the state line in North Carolina. In Georgia, eight defendants face 136 charges and one hardcore poacher has 99 charges against him. A total of 20 bears were killed, 10 in each state. With this Access News break, I'm B.J. Williams.